Hello and welcome back to Phoenix Point. And uh, I, I just spotted that the the place we raided last time, facilities building, they are unfriendly by four. They actually love me quite a bit, to be fair. But we can still recruit the guy. They're like, well, he bashed up our, our factory, but he cut our thieves, right? Man. I feel so bad about it. I don't plan on doing that ever again. They, that's what they want. They want me to sabotage. <clears throat> I don't like that. And that's a mission on the other side of the world. I mean, it can be. I'm pretty sure it can be any farther than <laughs> where we are. <coughs> Good job. So, where are we heading? We can go down, but we are scanning here and we are just not getting anywhere. Also, the mist is spreading. Hmm. We can go towards some question marks. We're missing some HP. <clears throat> but, screw that. We're still gonna be fine. Personnel. Oh, yeah, actually, the new guy is ready for duty. Uh, Manticore. <clears throat> oh crap, I don't have bullets. What is this shit? Okay, we can carry more stuff. <clears throat> this is gonna be... Uh, well, it should be a secondary weapon, and that's the plan. <coughs> Damn it, I can't talk now. Unless you guys want me to sound like Batman. We can do that. The Batman. Batman episode. Or like, few episodes, just keep going. <clears throat> but no. I must resist. Uh, yeah, I mean, this is okay. The personnel is ready for action. We're missing a fair bit of HP. Six hours to heal. Should you just, you know, have a timeout? <clears throat> Although I feel like she's quite critical, usually, to the success of the party. But, uh, let's explore. <clears throat> oh, we found another Synedrion Haven. Anarcho-communism. We can raid them. They're a little bit friendly to us. I'm sure. Whatever. <clears throat> let's, let's keep looking around. <clears throat> a Synedrion satirist, satirist, what is this? I'm not familiar with it. <clears throat> In a new Shanai, has been causing diplomatic problems by writing a series of increasingly popular songs about the disciples of Anus. The disciples demand an end to these insults. <clears throat> While Synadrion cite their unwavering dedication to freedom of speech. I mean, okay. Side with Disciples of Anu, it's their rights. Side with Synadrion, without freedom of speech, humanity can flourish. I agree. I have to throw my head in with Synadrion here. <laughs> I didn't like that. <laughs> oh man. Oh, look at that! A flying dick! It's Paulina. Pa Paulina is uh, captaining that flying dick. What's going on here? <clears throat> we can area scan. Let's explore. Scan complete. Wait. Our operatives have located an abandoned camp previously used by local paramilitary organization during the waning days of World War III. Dozens of socially undesirable people were executed here. It appears to have been briefly used as a shelter, but the doors to the main building have been ripped off their hinges and skeletons littered the corridors. Let's search the site. <clears throat> okay, it's tough. Uh, well, we know about that. Let's check it out. <clears throat> Okay, uh, that's the research. New research available, again. Uh, let's just keep on export site. Uh, explore it. 
That seems to be a good way to deal with unexplored stuff. <coughs> Should drink. Uh, one of the Anu soldiers at uh, New Zealand is asking to join the Phoenix Project. He's been an admirer of our organization ever since hearing about it when he was a child. And now that it is more than just a legend, he wants to do his best to contribute to our cause. <clears throat> oh, that's his line. I've been training ever since I heard the Phoenix Project was back! Wow! You know, I never believed all the lies they told about you. If governments of the old world had supported you when it mattered, well, I guess it is what it is, but I want to help. <clears throat> Reject him as a filthy mutant. Tell him his haven needs him. No, we need you. <clears throat> Soldier grins. I, I get to join the Phoenix Project? Wow! The Exalted must have blessed me in my sleep. I can't believe this is happening. Uh, Drew the Viking Wildman. Fuck yeah! What a cool nickname! This is Drew, Vi Drew Wildman is pretty cool in the first place. <clears throat> Welcome aboard, Drew. Uh, hopefully you're gonna be... Actually... Can you just uh, a little bit fuck off here? He is... Can we just know? Oh, he's actually level three. He's uh, he's on the on board the Manticore one. There's only one problem with it that he doesn't have. Does he have gear? He fucking has gear too. No, what? How the fuck you look like? <clears throat> he has a special training, right? He's a berserker, and he has 100 skill points spare. His equipment actually he has gear. Fuck yeah. Uh, let's see what he has. He has an armored head. <laughs> what? <clears throat> oh, head mutation. Disciple Samanu, armored head mutation. I like this. Immune to day's effects. Uh, pretty armor. Uh, lower perception, but who cares about that? Lower uh, accuracy. That kind of matters quite a bit, so he's probably better suited for short range fights. Uh, Disciple Samanu, berserker body armor. It's. It's very weak, so replacing this would be preferable, but but it also gives him speed, so he has 16 speed with this. And he has stomper legs, uh, sorry about your stompy legs. <clears throat> Perform shock attack of, uh, shock attack affecting foftile radius, dazing targets if shock value uh, higher than target hit points, uh, shock damage falls off with range. <clears throat> but it doesn't say how much it deals. We have am ammo, uh, we have uh, a pistol, which deals 100 damage for two action points. That seems pretty fucking good, despite the fact, you know, but we have some minus accuracy here. Wait, this is plus accuracy? Wow, that's, that's good. So, he's about zero accuracy. I didn't quite do the math, but... Yeah, he has zero accuracy, <clears throat> which is fine. At least he doesn't have penalty because going from one hundred to seventy is uh is, is, is quite the penalty, <clears throat> or even more if you have that. Uh, this pistol looks good, I have to say. Uh, Disciples of Anu Blade, Dragon's Tooth. This is like one hundred. Every actually, this is two action points to use, but only one hand. They are like both one hand only. <clears throat> it looks okay. It looks pretty good. Uh, yeah, I mean, he can just use, uh, uh, crap. We need to, wait. We can give him a, a medkit. I mean, it doesn't look like a medkit, but I guess it's a medkit. I guess I'm not gonna argue with that. <clears throat> uh, what about his training? Adds to willpower and two and uh, to perception range. Whatever. <clears throat> He's good at throwing grenades. I mean, that would be good if uh, we actually had grenades. The next attack deals... 50 additional shred damage. Ooh, what? Holy shit, that's really good. <clears throat> uh, so we can just shred everybody. I mean, yeah, let's let's pick that up. I mean, yeah, that's good. Attacks from enemies within 10 tiles deal 25% less damage. That's pretty good too. Especially if it, uh, you know, it deals 25% less damage than the armor gets. Uh, considered because for example if you get hit for 40 and you have 30 armor 
and you know, and that 40 gets reduced to 30, then it hits your armor, then you get no damage, you know? And it kind of matters, but if you, the armor hits you first, <clears throat> if, if it hits your armor first, then gets reduced, I think that's how it works, but maybe not. <clears throat> because when you take damage, because you're taking damage, I don't know. It, it could be either, actually, it kind of depends on the games. But this looks pretty good. Uh, he has good enough speeds. <clears throat> Uh, I don't know about his armor break, but strength is nice, and having health could uh, help him not die. I don't know if he wants... Well, this gives us speed too. So currently... So this way, he can move quite a bit. <clears throat> but that's not good enough. This can also give him willpower, but how much do we care about that? Choosing new class, we're probably not gonna do that, so maybe we're just gonna go for health now. Just to make sure we don't lose him. <coughs> I'm really glad he joined up. But we can all, only take one more guy. Uh, yeah, I guess we're checking that out. Wait. Explore. Okay, another haven. Sure. A purple airship and a green flying dildo. <clears throat> oh, that's pretty good. Yeah, let's, let's just get everybody on board. <clears throat> Always check your soldier stamina when uh, sending them on a mission. Yeah, I know. I just keeps uh, telling me the same trick uh, tips, so... Who cares? I already learned this. Uh, this guy's not exactly, uh, quite ready. The only place where he has armor, he also storing the grenades, so if he gets hit a little an inch higher than his shoulder pad, then he is everything blows up, and all the grenades he has. <clears throat> questionable. Very questionable. I mean, he looks cool, but questionable. Unless he's not even a soldier, he's just, uh, a welder with a death fish, maybe. Could be a could be a thing because of his glasses. <clears throat> maybe a Valder pirate could be could be a thing. And I don't really see anyone go rocking this style these days. Okay, uh, we got a mutant here, <clears throat> hopefully uh, my team is going to be fine with that. Kill all enemies, and uh, they're probably going to be pretty busy, just wrecking stuff. What's our plan? So we got Cameron, dragons, uh, dragon beards. Hmm. <clears throat> the question is, if we come over here, do we open the door? Okay, Fred. Uh, let's go there. Let's go. <clears throat> Receiving loud and clear. Bernardo O'Higgins. Yeah, I, I kind of want to just go into the open. There, we might have a pretty good chance. <clears throat> Holy shit! Two enemies spotted. Where? Okay, far away. But it still matters a lot. We only have one sniper now. Or any, actually, we have two snipers. But we don't have the main sniper with us. We just have a, a, a very low level sniper and a sniper assault. Is the scout, but even she can go too far. <laughs> okay, that's a door. I thought that was Here. a window. On the double. I'll just get closer. <clears throat> 
And last, we got uh, Drew the Viking Wildman. Although we can still, like... I, I don't want to get closer. He's like a... Yeah, I don't know where he should go. He has okay speed. Can we just... No. Uh, we are not going there. I don't know where to take him. <coughs> He's running around with his sword. Okay, whatever. End turn. Are we gonna get shot? Oh shit. Fuck off, crabs. Part of three of us. <coughs> okay. But there's also a guy here who's overwatching. Unclear with what? He's using his shit machine gun, which is fine. Dragon beards. I don't really wanna go into the middle of the map. I'm ready. Okay. We got a hell cannon here. To fire. Is that like a completely hopeless scenario? I mean, this seems okay. <clears throat> what I would like to try using it with like accuracy items. Maybe it's it's actually really good. We can dash in to almost guarantee a hit. This is not a guaranteed hit, but like it's it's damn close. And it's pretty good. <clears throat> Uh, yeah, I'll just get a little closer. That's fine for now. We have a sniper. There's not much we can do with that. Maybe just shoot at people from very far away. I wanna find a, maybe a better angle, but it's a little unlikely. No, we can go over here maybe. Let's see the angle we got. So this is a lot better angle. <clears throat> One disadvantage is that we are farther away. So Heading I can out. go there. Try to go for a shot. <clears throat> Comes online. We can't really go too far. Okay, let's go over here and hit the, the same guy. We got them. I'm not sure what to do with the heavies. I can't even find a good position to go to. Right there. Maybe to go on Overwatch. A very, very hopeful Overwatch. <clears throat> uh, yeah, you're not doing anything here. I don't know if I want to rush in. We know about two guys, but I suspect there is someone at least on the left. Uh, there are no windows here. That's what I was uh, checking. Let's do this. Can we open the door? So we didn't. Okay, that's fine for now. We got the Berserker guy. He can stun for two, and he can armor break for four. <clears throat> that's good information. So we might wanna up his uh, willpower. By two, at least. Two free points. You can just try to close in the guy. I'm not sure if he should go on a solo mission. But there's not much else he can do. And that's it for now. <clears throat> Is he overwatching? Oh, I was like, 
Really? I get shot? I can go close and break his shield. <clears throat> the other problem with it is that it's not gonna be enough damage. We only deal 100 damage as far as I know. We can check. 100 damage with both, and it's gonna cost us at least two action points to move up. And no, we can't even do that. So we can do some kind of a pistol action. We can stomp. <clears throat> Wait, is that not a... Oh, that's not a door. Oh man. Hell cannon. Can we just dash? So let's dash in quite a lot. Dash! It's one dash. Still pretty far away. What if we dash again? Over here. Dash! Then get closer. <clears throat> like over there. And target. Oh, crap. Armor doesn't matter. <laughs> what is this action? Double dash run. Well, we got a willpower out of that, so... <clears throat> Fine. I'm ready. Ah, uh, are you though? He's not. He's definitely not ready. He can't go anywhere. He needs a, a secondary uh, weapon. A sniper would be nice. I'm not not really loving the heavy. I think one heavy armor guy is basically the cap. Or at least probably that's more ideal than what I'm I'm running right now. Is it possible to spot the guy? No. Can I spot him? Okay, let's switch to the pistol. From over here we can spot him. We can go with the uh, armor break. Armor break pistol. And take a shot at him. The equipment is only damaged. We we took a little bit of damage. Let's see what we got. <clears throat> that was pretty much worthless. Oh, he's he's all good. What a bastard! How do we get him? I have no idea. Uh. Uh, what? Oh yeah, I can't overwatch with him. <clears throat> we can use uh, the assault rifle, maybe. Repositioning, prioritizing speed. I think we're lo losing that box. Uh, even Mobius can do it. I'm on the move. He's only well, she is only. I'm not not as bad with genders, but you know, <laughs> I mean when I'm looking at them, I mean I, I can't tell, okay? It doesn't matter too much Okay, uh, we can see the enemy from over here But it's probably gonna be a, a lost cause I mean, I'm not sure what I expected. Running. Just go in. <clears throat> I like dash a lot. That the assaults have. Uh, let's just go back. I think we're losing that box. No! Get out of 
yeah, yeah. That's 100 resources lost. Okay. Do we really deal 100 damage here? And is that enough? So let's get close. <clears throat> let's get out the melee. And I guess we're gonna attack. We can also bash him, but we're doing a strike. Disabled like... Oh, what? Didn't that hurt? That hurt quite a bit. <laughs> What about the face hugger? Who's gonna deal with that? Channel open. Oh, she's going to. <clears throat> we do a dash, and a dash, and a dash. Hey, don't worry about this, mate. You're good. Let's bash the face hugger. It's not as scary, but I imagine, like, like that's not how it gets scary, but <clears throat> in a very hectic scenario, it's gonna be super scary. I can't get him. What's our plan? <clears throat> I can see the enemy. And we have no dash. Ah, uh, that's it. I can do an overwatch. Um, there's maybe like one other option to consider. If we get close, I aim at this box. This got rid of the entire box. <clears throat> and now... Ready to fire. We have free aim. Although... Sniper might be a better choice. I shouldn't hit my own guy. <clears throat> and that's a win, I guess. We, we lost one box, at least. Scavenging site. Yeah, one injured. Cameron Dragonbeards, uh, on level 5. I'm a little surprised that only now. Relations with factions cannot be cannot progress to supportive until you complete their diplomacy mission. <coughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's gonna be, take some time. We can fly uh, to India now, but do I really want to? No, I don't. So I got a uh, bunch of resources and uh, a rocket ammo. That's nice. So I guess we're gonna go and uh, just deal with uh, other missions on the right. Uh, yeah, explore. <clears throat> oh, new research. We just got... Okay, we'll see. Yeah, manufacturing. Maybe I should read it a little bit more. But there was like nothing obvious that uh, jumped up. And making the scarab, it's gonna be ready in three days. Who doesn't want to see that? No hostile forces have been detected, but there are probably some resources we can find here. Let's do that. 500 mats. Now, I'm a little concerned here. We have... We can go for one more mission. And we, we probably will. Let's explore. But then we have to go back home. Oh, you have located a phoenix base and brought it back online? Fuck yeah! <clears throat> really? 
base info. So we have vehicle bay. We have... Oh my god, this is great stuff. You know what we, What else we gotta do? Maybe do uh, an area scan, like another one. It's the base info. And uh, vehicles with base 0 out of 2. <clears throat> Perfect. <laughs> Just the way I like it. Uh, we have enough uh, area scans to last of, uh, us a lifetime for now. Base 1 and 2. What I like the most, what I would like the most, personal base. Okay, fine. Oh, we can just have, uh, yeah. Birdies. Repair facility. How much is gonna cost me? Okay, let's do that. <clears throat> yeah, let's do that. And you can just have multiple things at the same time. We have bigger storage, we have an energy generator. Uh, that barely gets used. What we can do is use that fucking energy. I would like a research lab, and I would would have liked the research lab for so long now. And I think, yeah, I mean, look at this. We have so so much tech. We can get research lab, and another research lab, and another research lab. I mean, that might be too much. <clears throat> I also like the idea of uh, going with a fabricator. Training facility. I mean, this is not really the facility where we just chill. This is not where I bring my guys to, you know, just like kick back after a mission. I, I would just like a bunch of research labs if that's if that's actually viable and possible. It's 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 a little pricey. It's gonna take us four days to get the soul down. <clears throat> but after that, probably my research is gonna be decent. Okay. <laughs> uh, I guess we can heal here. I'm just scanning just so we have access to everything, and we're gonna go back to the other base. <clears throat> That's where we're gonna chill. Research lab. In four days. Base info. Yeah, we are making a, a buggy here. <clears throat> this is mostly the uh, the soldier chill base. Okay, we can go for uh, a training. Reloading any inventory actions do not cost any action points. I mean. Meh, a little bit. We have uh, 20 speed, we can up it technically to 25. <clears throat> I wouldn't be against that, like, can we just explore that option? Wait, what? I would need to push it to 23. So, she's super fast. And that's kind of what she does. She with the dash. <clears throat> okay. She's the scout. She doesn't really have a, like a crazy backup weapon. We have a Phoenix Mer Mercy shotgun. And I I made that for a good reason. Yeah. He plans to have that as a backup weapon. Uh actually Let's get ammo for these. <clears throat> uh, both of them, that's fine. Bernardo wants to have that as a backup weapon. He is an assault, but he also uh, can snipe. And now I have access to an extra assault rifle and an extra heavy weapon. But I'm not sure who would like the assault rifle. Uh, he's a sniper with nothing else going on. He is just weird. Uh, I think when it comes to his training, he likes uh, melee and handguns. Okay, then. Eric. Uh, doesn't have much else going on. He's just a good sniper. <clears throat> Nikita. Can learn to how to snipe. But. I don't have a sniper. And I'm not sure even that would be a great pick. But I think it, it's worth bringing. Uh, we got Fred here, who actually would really like 
a secondary weapon. <clears throat> Wait, what? This is only three weights? Wow. Uh, let's take some ammo for the AR. So we can have both. Alright, cool. Uh, bases are progressing. There's nothing with diplomacy that we can do. Well, okay then. So we found a new base. Really good news. And this base is better because this base is uh, just... Uh, well, it, it, it reaches some stuff. <clears throat> Wait. Uh, we need to uh, wait a little bit. Just wait for the team to heal up. Viking actually is slightly wounded. I'm not sure how slightly. Uh, Viking is just gonna wait and uh, Eric is going to come on the mission. So that way we don't have to chill at home. You don't have any area scan users remaining. <clears throat> yeah, I, I triggered all of them. Um, maybe I was too eager there. But we definitely know about some areas up top. <clears throat> Let's do that. S what? Oh, scan completed. I wonder if he can find new stuff. Wait, elite training constructed? What? They don't like me. Why not? Let's be friends. Re we repair stuff? I mean, it's gonna take us a long time. Uh, I don't already know about the slugs. Surprisingly agile with limited high jump capability, immune to fire, weaknesses uh, relatively easy to kill, vulnerable to explosive. How do they know what this is? I mean, what would be cool here is that, you know, you maybe have this information up front, but I already had to learn how to deal with this. So it's a little pointless. It's too little too late. We can do an area scan over there, but maybe do it over there. Uh, another base with a big a purple dildo and we can get a guy but it's it's more about it's less about getting a guy and, and more about just getting resources uh, to actually uh, get him gear I suppose at that point you might well just say like oh I just get good gear too <clears throat> abandoned let's look for stuff 70 food let's pop an area scam Oh, we can look over there. But... Uh, let's say that can wait. Let's keep going. Well, we know about this. Let's explore. I don't really mind that we have three area scans. I think it would be doable with two. And it just seemed like yes. maybe it's... We need to achieve some kind of peace. And we in Synedrion aren't unwilling to fight. But winning is more than just building the biggest army. To win, we need a functional infrastructure. We need people who can plan. We need a system that works. So they don't like New Jericho. So what? Why are you telling me this? Uh, oh crap. That's very far away though. Let's search the haven. We found stuff. Can I save them? Freedom and necessity. Alejandro Soko. I mean, despite all the crap, I don't want people to die. Can I save them? I just tried to show up in time. Complete. Yeah, threat level medium, light level night. 
Well, let's go then. Apparently we are ready. So what are we waiting for? <clears throat> Perlas Perla paralysis damage will inflict an action point penalty based on the paralysis damage value compared to the target strength. If paralysis value is greater than strength, then the victim is totally paralyzed. Okay. Uh, these special damages don't really come into play yet. Uh, the game obviously has more classes than initially you have access to, like uh, Assault, uh, Sniper, and uh, Heavy, that's what we got, but we also found the Berserker, and I suppose <clears throat> there are other factions uh, who have other special uh, <laughs> units. I'm not a huge fan of the Berserker though, it's a melee combatant, so I range is more my jam. I think he's fine. Kill all enemies, key structures protected 100%. Pretty big place. So... Hell Cannon 2. Let's get a little closer. Thieving, loud and clear. I don't really loot these. I mean, you can loot and get gear, but I mean, <clears throat> as far as I know, you always get it at the end of the mission. And at that point, okay, you can Let's go by five. She's the scout. We don't know about anything. Okay. Well, these are gonna be damn popular. And these are the secondary location. So, people would wanna come here to smash it up. Oh, that's heavy cover. Okay. I'm not sure where to go. Isn't the tree supposed to give me heavy cover? Moving <clears> out. I don't want it. <laughs> also, I, I, I'm carrying so much stuff that no, <laughs> I can't take it. Okay. Loud and clear. Channel open. So this is the sniper assault. Let just do overwatch. Regular sniper. Ah, uh, Haywire. Well, I shouldn't call her regular. She's really good. Oh, we got a guy. There. Uh, we can't make that shot. However, we can definitely go for an overwatch. Hal Cannon. I just get close, okay? <clears throat> just keep getting closer. It might be even worth considering flying up. I might even do that right now. I'm just a little hesitant to do that because you commit to a big movement. And if you get into enemy territory, you're super fucked. But he's just gonna chill for now. Wait, what? Uh, no, we can't reach the... I can't see the key structures from up top. Never mind that. So we got a sniper here. Uh, she's not that good, but she's still okay. She's gonna learn to be a better sniper. And... Uh, I don't know. I don't, I don't wanna commit to... Too deep. So I think that's gonna be it for now. <laughs> Fuck you. I might not be able to save those. 
Sniper shot. I like the movement. <laughs> Of that particular unit, which is called a Triton. Cool design. Uh, anyway, back to not losing this mission. Yeah. Uh, they're really covering the middle of the map. Can I just have the rookies go for some shots? From over there, I'm on the move. we might be able to see somebody. Let's see if that's true. Uh, barely, and he's gonna bleed to death. <clears throat> so I think the better choice here is to maybe go for an Overwatch. Providing Overwatch. Oh, I don't really have to. I don't really like to Overwatch as an opener. Acquiring target. We still see the weak, weak guy. He's gonna die to bleed, I'm pretty sure of that. And we can't see the guy in the back. Can we see the guy in the back? From here we can see the guy in the back. From here, no. From here, yes. Moving now. I wanna kill the guy in the back. Can we actually do it? Oh man. It's not a great angle. Am I still attempted? So, huh? Let's say we dash here. And we go for a headshot. Oh, that's not a headshot. Oh, that is heavily armored. Now we can go for a headshot in an odd way. Removes our ability Silent Echo. Can we remove his pink chameleon? Yes. Kind of, but not in a not easy. So he's gonna take no. This this is this barely is gonna be good enough, and removes his pink chameleon. Uh, but let's just shoot him in the head. Ready to fire. Well, you didn't get too far. Okay, then. So, uh, this is the assault sniper. Uh, we don't have to be concerned with this guy who's gonna bleed out. We just need to start closing in on the guys wrecking the, the right room. Should we just fly there? Let's do that. Oh, we, that might just now. break the window. Can you see anybody? He needs a different weapon. Oh, enemy spotted who? Oh shit. I didn't know about that. I don't know. Maybe go there. So, yeah, keep that in mind. Uh, start getting closer. Uh, technically, I can dash, but uh, we might just save that for next turn. Yeah, I don't have any more action points left. We lose one, but we might be able to. Well, not like that. 
Fair enough. Only three bullets. I can't go for two, two shots, right? Okay, then. So we got Fred in Fred No Blin. Uh, going in for a dash. Wait, do we have three guys here? No time to lose. Yep. Can you somehow drop down? No. There's no way to drop down. Does opening the door open. gives us any angles? Actually, maybe. It's a pretty awkward angle, but it might work. I think it's that. Yeah, it's that. What else we got? Yeah, he's not good. What else we got? Another sniper. Uh, he can only see the bleeding uh, enemy. No choice but to keep going. Uh, we can make a headshot, maybe. Just don't hit the serapis. Torso and head. That's that's good. Enemy down. And uh, of course, go for a heal. That's fine. Yeah, you're not gonna do anything anymore. Heavy. The only thing he can do is maybe go in for a punch. That's possible. Yeah. This sniper just needs to close in. To even hope to do something. What else we got? The assault sniper. I actually sees quite a lot. That's a decent shot. With the firebird. I don't think the assault rifle is gonna be as good. <laughs> what? Yeah, that's the shotgun. Never mind that. Ah, uh, yeah. Serapis, maybe try to ignore that. And don't shoot the gun. Oh, he's not gonna die, but uh, a punch might actually take him out. So that is the the ideal target. Uh, him? And the heavy. Oh shit. So you just can't leave them bleeding. That's not good enough. Does it say that they counterattack? You, you can't know from uh, just their description. Is this good enough though? How much? This is two. Oh, he can keep going, so yeah, we have enough. Running. We're just gonna go in front of it and punch it. Okay, well, there's not much we can do here. Uh, leaving them bleeding is, uh, I mean, that's an option, but uh, it's not safe. Okay, director leveled up to level 3. Uh, Edge Mobius didn't really get much done. <laughs> what? Only 67% got protected? Uh, okay, fine. I mean, we helped. We came at the right time.
There better be some juicy rewards here. Mates. And apparently my... My, uh... My reputation can't increase before I actually do their faction mission. Which is just massive total bullshit. What the hell is this? By 10? Uh... Is this a weapon? No, that's ammo. Disciples of Anu shotgun. Cool. So, this didn't increase my reputation with them. What the fuck? Oh, you want me to sabotage New Jericho Haven energy generation? We can do that. Why not? Let's just be friends. <laughs> Why not? So, research. We got new research here. I got a bunch of stuff lined up. I can reverse engineer it if I want to make more. Of these uh, shotguns. This is a better sniper, but by reverse engineering it, I would actually lose the one I got, I'm pretty sure. And gain the ability to make more. Which is fine, long term, but we can wait with that. So, 52 SP, we have the ability to dash, gain PDV and handgun proficiency with plus 20 damage dealt, and 10 hearing range. So, he can be the very best sniper <laughs> as an assault. Although I'm not sure if we need this pistol proficiency. I mean, we can just do fine with shotguns and assault rifles, so... I mean, that kind of works. I'm not sure how much we're gonna use return fire. Uh, we have enough speed. I can up my willpower. Just a little bit, so we can at least dash. And maybe just get more HP. Like that. And more carry capacity. We can always just take some uh, uh, medkits. I mean, that, that works. Is this a better shotgun? Deals more damage. With a uh, very, very much... A little, a little bit shorter range. I don't know. Does this really matter? Okay, just 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 take the sh wait. This is is the shotgun magazine. Wait, what? I just oh, I was like oh. It actually counts as like you you shoot all the pellets, and all the pellets are are counted individually. So, this one actually has eight shot I mean, six shots, and this one has five shots. Just something to consider. <clears throat> On top of the, the range difference. But I suppose dealing 80 more damage is uh, probably uh, a better uh, feature. Uh, we don't have enough bullets in the gun. Great stuff! A shotgun, yeah. Cameron could really use this shotgun. Especially because she runs around quite a bit. I just use that shotgun. That's fine. And at this point, we can just consider going back to base. Because we're a little tired. And uh, the scan is still running. We'll still have uh, a lot to do. We can just go back to base. And we did a scan here. And we only managed to find this unexplored site in the mist. Uh, I guess we're gonna wait a little bit. Scan complete. Just so we are not tired. Dragon. Uh, Fred, in Fred, no Blin. 
is just gonna decide to stay at Phoenix Point and we're gonna take Drew the Viking. Uh, the Scarab is gonna be ready in a day. Okay. Uh, we can do their special mission. That way, we wouldn't be wasting our, our time. But that's pretty far away. But if we did that, then we would be able to gain more reputation with the faction. I'm pretty sure I already did that. That's why it's... That's why it's not a question mark. I don't know if you can pop a scan there. We would need to pop a scan here. Uh, of course, there are some specific locations we can go to and probably uh, pop scans there. Just go somewhere else. But currently, we don't really have other bases other than the one we managed to find in uh, kind of Canada. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, we still have to explore this area. I kind of want to. It's it's close. It's close. Why not? But also, I kind of want to go here. Because if we did this, we did this, we popped the search. And next time we came back, we would have somewhere to go, I, I imagine. And then we can just head up and uh, try to finish that. And I'm pretty sure there is just... Wait, what? What is this? Oh, we know about a uh, specific faction base here? Fine. But we somehow need to deal with the mist because this is bullshit. At any rate, uh, thanks for watching guys and see you next time.